Hey everyone, in section 7 we wrapped up the settings and about page and in section 8 we'll start working on upgrading the application to Ionic 5. First, we will start with updating the Ionic CLI globally in the machine and then we will upgrade our application to the latest Ionic 4x version which is 4.11.10. So let's see what the steps we have. So first of all, as I said, we need to install the Ionic 5 globally. And in order to do that, you should know that the package name has changed. So we have to uninstall the Ionic package and then we will install the add Ionic slash CLI package globally. And then we should be able to verify by doing Ionic dash dash version. So let's get started. So I'm on my terminal now and you can run this command from anywhere in your machine, but I'm just running everything from the project. So you can see that we have now uninstalled the Ionic package. And now we will install the ionic slash CLI package. So we can simply say npm install dash g at ionic slash CLI. And now we will just install the package. Cool, so you can see that now we have installed the package and if we do ionic version, we should be able to see the 6.6.0 as well. So now we are good with updating the global ionic package. The next step for us is to update the Ionotes application to the latest ionic 4 version. And in order to do so, we will just do npm install at ionic slash angular and then we will specify the version 4.11.10. So let's do that. So I'm back on my terminal and I'm just going to paste this command and let's see once this is installed. Alright, so you can see that the package is installed now and if I do ionic info, we should be able to see the ionic angulars 4.11.10 version in there as well. So let's check that out. Alright, so if I scroll up, you can see that now the ionic framework version is ionic angular 4.11.10 and that's actually it for this step. Now we have done a first step towards upgrading to Ionic 5. 